Hey guys, it's Larry Greenberg, and today we're taking a look at the findables case for the iPhone 5. This case comes in a wide variety of colors and each sells for $29.95. So the findables case is essentially a snap on the back case that comes with an app. And the app is used to configure the QR code that is stamped to the back of the case. And you can set up a profile, actually three different profiles, based on what you want the person that scans the QR code on the back of your case to receive. More on that in a second. First, let's crack this open to show you that there is really nothing in here other than the case itself. And essentially what this is, is a soft touch snap on the back style case for the iPhone 5. So I'll place it on my phone first and then I'm gonna remove it so I can scan it. Snaps on quite easily, really nice soft touch finish. And then again, it's got that QR code there that says scan to find me and the findables logo. Definitely a lot going on in the back of this case. You can see the kind of square-ish or rectangle-ish shaped cutout for the camera, secondary mic and flash. And then of course, everything is open, the side, the top and the bottom, fully accessible. A little bit of lay on the table protection thanks to the corners that sort of extend up. So first things first, I'll show you that you actually use this app that's in the app store. It's a free download to set up your profile essentially. And you can use it to do, um, to set up kind of three different profiles. So once you add your case, it shows up there and you can add as many cases as you want. And then you can actually choose to have it set to one of three things. One is a business profile, and I'll kind of show you all these in a second. Two is a social media profile, and three is a lost profile. So over here, you actually configure each of these. So the business, you can add a photo, you can add your title, your biography, you can add social networks, your website, the links, add a business card, you know, virtual business card with all of your info, your phone number, your email, and all that stuff. So that when someone scans that, that's what they get. You can see right now, that's what I have the QR code selected as. So when someone scans my code, it'll show them the business profile. But let's say I wanted to set up just to so show social. There's my social profile, so I can add like all of my social networks there, and you can see the choices, Instagram, Facebook, so that when someone scans that and I have it set to do that, it will show all those and finally lost. So I can set up a custom message here saying, you know, reward or call this number or whatever I want. I can put in alternate phone numbers and email addresses. So again, whatever I choose here under the cur current profile, that's, gonna, that's what's gonna show up when the person scans uh, my QR code. So, you know, the business one, you might do as like a, at a trade show or an event. The social media one, you might keep on on a more regular basis, and then, or even the lost one. And then it also features a QR reader. So I'm actually gonna pop this off just so you can see how this works. Pop the case off, go into the app, and then scan my own code just so you can see what happens. So there it goes, scan. That's a little fingerprint on it, and it took me right to my business profile, which is what I had enabled. So pretty neat, kind of a, you know, unique use of a QR code. One of the only cases they claim, the only case that comes with its own app, which very well might be true. Um, but if there's someone, number one, who is losing your phone often and you don't wanna, you know, um, enable or don't always have the Find My iPhone feature enabled, you wanna rely on the, you know, good heart of other people to scan that code if they find your phone, you can do that. Again, if you wanna just share your info with other people that have QR readers, most phones nowadays, except the iPhone, come with QR readers built in. There are a ton of free ones of course for the iPhone, but I think Android phones now are coming with it. But you know, certainly um, it's not a technology that's you know huge out there. It's kind of slow to take off, but maybe it'll be around for um, some time to come. So that's been my brief look at the Findables iPhone case for the iPhone 5. You can check it out via the website that I'll put in the video description. Of course, if you um, would be so kind is to click the annotation link in the upper left-hand corner, read my full review of this case over on runaroundtech.com. I'd be most appreciated uh, or appreciated and as always, you know you can leave me a comment down below if you have any questions. Otherwise, have a great day.